have to Divine Brown, who um, performed fellatio on Hugh Grant and has skyrocketed into uh, national fame. Who knew? Who knew? That that was the lick that would be heard around the world. Maybe you should lick more guys. Yes, <laughs> yes. Could really uh, bring some uh, publicity to the show. I'm thinking. How many pu- people in Divine Brown's uh, entourage? Seven. Seven. Well, there you go. And I listed them all for you. <laughs> wow. You listed them all for me? Yep. When did you list them all for me? Right here. Right here on this piece of paper. Don't oh, give oh. it to him. Oh, I see. Okay, we'll take a break. Until yeah. it's time. Yeah, yep. Don't give it to me until we get on the air. <laughs> I'm here to promote my movie that I just done, um, uh, The Vines on Sunset. And uh, it's a really hot movie. And I think a lot of, a lot of, I think a lot of guys will enjoy it. Also a lot of women. You know, um, it's, it's like we reenact the play. The play? Yeah. So, so why'd, you, why'd you come up here to Howard's show? I come up to the Howard show because I, I adore his show, his radio station. You know, I think he's a cool guy. Guy. Do you really do you be a fan of Howard's? Yeah. Really? Yes, I am. Do you, do you listen to him? Do you think he's Do you think he's attractive? Um. Yes, he is. <laughs> yeah. Like, I like his like long that. black hair. <laughs> you like that? Yeah. So, uh, so you nervous about going in there at all? Oh, not at all. I'm ready. I'm ready. No? To... You ready? I mean, you know, Shoot obviously, you, I'm sure you're gonna have a lot of stories. Obviously, you're gonna have the Hugh Grant story, and you might have other stories. Who? Uh, yeah. Who? <laughs> you know, the one that this whole video is about. <laughs> no, the video is about divine. Right, but it's. A, <laughs> Don't you have like a little remake a little in there? Yes, right? I do. <laughs> so, I mean, you're going to have a lot of the stories, I'm sure. Yeah. So you're not nervous about talking all, no. talking all that stuff? You're pretty open? Yeah. You're pretty open? Yeah. So. I've been open all my life, but, <laughs> <laughs> but you know, right. I'm going for it. Yeah. So, you know. All right, cool. So, uh, so just hang tight. I think you'll be going on pretty soon, all right? Okay. All right, sure thanks. Thing. Ready to roll. You ready? Okay. Good. I'll be back. Let me get uh, Divine Brown in here, who... I don't believe she's been interviewed anywhere, has she? I don't know. We'll have to ask. Maybe she's done a magazine article. I don't think she's ever been interviewed live. Nah. wonder if she's still hooking or, like, like can you go down somewhere and get her? Or is she, like, now a... I think she's off the street. She's got a whole entourage out there. She's with uh, Jack. I uh, saw Jack. Yeah, Latoya's husband. Yeah. See Divine. Wow. Wow. Man, you don't look bad at all, honey. I'll tell you. Not at all. <laughs> Look at you. Whoa. I'd pay for that. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah. You got a, you got a fancy hairdo on. Don't mess it up with those headphones. There you yeah. go. Hey. You smell good too. Mm. What are you wearing, honey? Fruity floil. Are wow, you really? Hey, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> what is that called? Fruity floil. Okay. Fruity floil? Yes. Fruity floil. Now, divine, you relax because uh, I'm a gentleman. You understand? Mm-hmm. Hmm. <laughs> You're not wearing a bra, are you? Do you never wear a bra? I, hey now. I have on a big fat bra. Oh, that is a bra. And it's not a miracle. Really? <laughs> you got nice breasts. Why, thank you. Are those yours natural or did you get implants? Natural. Those are what, C cups? Uh, yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You're a pretty girl, you know what I mean? Everyone thinks like a, you know, yeah, a hooker. Usually you think hookers don't look so good. Ex-hooker, you know? ex-hooker. Okay. Oh, is that right? Okay. But yeah. at the time. <laughs> at the time. At the time. Street, ho- you know, when you, a typical street hooker, mm-hmm. and you weren't even charging that much. How much were you charging for some fellatio? A fellatio, maybe. Um, 20? I'm going to keep you wondering. No, really. What, what, is it, what does it cost? Yeah, to what is a Hugh, <laughs> yeah, Hugh Grant was looking for cheap. He got a Hugh Grant it? special at the time. Yeah, but you didn't even know it was Hugh Grant, so you were charging him what any customer gets. Only so he pulled up in a nice car. Yeah, he no, not even that. What was he driving? He was in a Rolls Royce. <laughs> he, was he in a Rolls Royce? No. No, what was he driving? A BMW. BMW, so you knew you could get a couple of bucks out of this. John, if you will. Not hardly. So how's a nice girl like you get into hooking? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, like, I mean, usually they're, you know, we've had some hookers up here, Howard, and uh, yeah, they're pretty sloppy. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? And I know there's all kind of hookers. You know what I mean? But you were doing street hooking, which is, you know, that's the most dangerous, is isn't that, it? Seriously? Yeah. It is, right? Yes. Hey, get closer was that, that your primary form of uh, hooking, or did you do other? I, I, types? no, I, I danced and I went out to go get tax-free money. No. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. you went out to bars and stuff and danced. Yeah. Yeah. And what happened? Did you get like, were you like a heroin addict or something? And you had to get money <laughs> to feed your habit? No. You got nice teeth too. Did you get braces as a kid? No. That's natural. Just eat good. Wow. Yeah. And what, and what, maybe as a young kid, did you ever get like psychoanalyzed? Have you ever been to a psychiatrist or something? No, didn't need yeah, to. When would she no? have done that, Howard? I don't know. <laughs> no, I'd get a couple of braces bucks. Braces and a psychiatrist? Yeah, I hey, I seen the movie, family. I seen the movie <laughs> Pretty Woman. She went to a shrink. No, not yet. No? Not yet. Oh, I'm saying like, like, were you one of those women who like, like, 
like after you got done with a night of work, you go home and like have to shower and stuff and like get the smell of men off you and all that. Yes, yeah, you would. Happening. You hate men. How many men a night? <laughs> how many? Not yeah, how many guys? Eleven. <laughs> how many guys were you handling a night? About two. Two. That's a lot. Come on. You, you go, girl. It's a secret. <laughs> Don't go there, girl. It's what do you mean a it's a secret? secret? <laughs> yes, it is. Well, what you're you? out of it now. Yeah, now it's, it's behind you, baby. Mm -hmm. You How prefer everything. You prefer white guys, black guys, Chinese? What's your preference? Who are the best customers? Yeah. England. <laughs> England? Really? What do you mean? <laughs> well, that's Hugh Grant. <laughs> yeah. No, but who is the best? White guys or black guys? <gasps> white guys. Really? You're into white guys? Uh-huh. Because mm. yeah. you're kind of light-skinned. That's a, a very big plus of the black community, isn't oh, it? Oh, here we go. With <laughs> Am I Wait, excuse me. Am I correct? <laughs> Don't you not. find that some of the dark-skinned black people are jealous of the light-skinned black people? Are they? <laughs> Tell the truth. Isn't that true? It could be. It's yes, it yes, could. Yes. You yeah. see, I told you. I know what's going on. I grew up in an all-black community, honey. You were yeah. one of the light-skinned black. I was a light-skinned black man for many years. <laughs> I'm telling you. Yeah. Mm, I like your shirt. Thank and you. I like your pants. I like the whole look. Thank you. I would, pref I would, uh, I would like to experience some fellatio. <laughs> so wait a minute, was that <laughs> like the, the market the look? <laughs> the best uh, trick you ever turned? Yeah. <laughs> no. What happens when a guy who looks like me pulls up? Do you run away from the car? <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. So what do you dress it like? What do you wear when you go out hooking? Like, do you wear like little hot pants? Yeah. Yeah, hot pants yeah, and it what? Depends on the weather. Let's say it's a warm <laughs> night. Do you wear like hot pants and boots? Yes. You do. The I thigh high, high boots? Yeah. Yeah, I dig that. The and then your hot pants show off your ass? Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah. I like that. No panties, right? Daisy Dukes. Daisy Dukes yeah. with your ass cheeks hanging not out. Lazy Dukes. No. <laughs> you're not lazy. You're working hard. <laughs> hey, it's work yeah. out there. Yeah, I know what you're saying, baby. It is. And, um, okay, so let me get this straight. So you're a kid growing up. Like, where did you grow up? Like, you know, where? South Central. You? California. California. What, South Central? No, not at all. The Bay Area. The yeah. Bay Area? Yeah. So you grew up what? Oakland. Oh, Oakland. Oakland. Oh, that's na that's nasty, Oakland. Yeah. That's a real tough Sound neighborhood. Richmond. Oh, that was what we were talking about the other day. That's where those six-year-old killed yeah, the baby. Yeah, killed the baby. Oh. Yeah. Bad shit. Isn't no. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, baby. I thought you was reformed. <laughs> 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 you just you said the at nasty s word. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you, the Richmond's a bad neighborhood. When you got done working for the night, would your jaw ever get sore? Or would you really like, you know, like, you know, get old? I didn't. I never worked myself that hard. Really? <laughs> it wasn't worth it. <laughs> you were lazy, baby. <laughs> now, it, was that all she did? That was like the most you would do? Yeah. Oh, you never had intercourse? Um. Or a special, John? Mm, no. You know what I'm saying? Someone handsome like myself? <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. Really? You would never have it? No, you had it, of course. Come on. No, I, I, I just used the five hands. Really? Know. Just the hands and the mouth. And I understand. Pretend like they're going into a tunnel. I see what you're saying. I got you, baby. Now, uh, did you good talk. Work. Do you always use condoms, or did you have to? Uh, always. Really? Yes. Never leave home without them. Now, if I was to give you a banana and a condom, how fast could you get a condom on a banana? Being a professional, ex-professional. Being a professional, like in three seconds. I got to oh, see really? that. No, come on. I got to see that. Here's your condom. See, I, I set myself up. I want to time you. Robin, you would have a race with oh, her. He's a race? I can't you. get it on probably at all. He's right. kidding me, right? No, <laughs> no I'm not kidding he's you. not kidding Here, me. hold this banana. You want me to hold this? <laughs> yeah, you hold the banana, Jackie, like it's a man. You have a race with her. All right, I'm going to clock you. have experience Here with this stuff. Uh, you, what, a condom? Uh, I can't put one on fast. Here. Now, Divine, you Look take this. Divine, just Divine here, Jackie. take this condom now. Let me see how fast you can do it. I don't believe you could do it in three seconds. One alligator, two alligator. Whoa, three alligator. Look at that. Oh, baby. Wow. Oh, yeah. No kidding. You are a pro. That's cool. Nice. You can keep that as a souvenir, by the way. <laughs> no, thank you. Now, Divine has a porno movie out, so you can see her in action. Wow. Now, what is that all about? She, now you're going into porno? It's about girls and men and guys and gals. I thought you were going to get into, uh, like, legitimate acting or something. Oh, that's legitimate. It is legitimate? Yes, it is. Yeah, the porno? Yeah. I'll watch it. Yeah. I'd like to see you in action, baby. It's legit. And do you uh, actually perform fellatio in this movie? Ah, uh, yeah. You do? Mm -hmm. Hey, now. Oh, right. <laughs> hey now. Hey now. Hey now. Hey now. That's right. So you're growing up as a, as like a, a, a little girl and stuff, and you were poor in the ghetto, right? <laughs> and it was hard for a young lady to make money, and all these guys were probably trying to molest you and stuff. Am I correct? Is that what got you into it? 
wrong. Were you ever molested as a child? No. No? no. Your daddy didn't have ham hands? Oh, no. here we go. Oh. <laughs> really? Obviously, it doesn't Not lead straight to the street, Howard. It seems that molesting leads to newscasting. Better leads the camera. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? It's not hooking. <laughs> <laughs> See, if you had been molested, you might have been my, uh, my, my, sidekick. my sidekick today. Yes. Probably so. That's huh? true. Any sisters at home that look like you? Unfortunately, I miss that beat, huh? Any sisters that look like you at home? Yes. Mm. There's three of us. Are they beautiful? Yes, they are. Are they into hooking? No, they're not. Yeah, I'll turn them out on the street if oh, I have to. Oh, thank you that's very right, much. That's right, that's <laughs> right. Same corner, I'll have all four sisters. <laughs> okay. No, I'm just kidding with you. You know that, baby. So how did your family feel when this whole thing happened? They were shocked. They were? Really? They didn't know what you were doing. They knew I was a dancer. Yeah. Was your daddy a preacher or something? No. What does he do? He's back in San Francisco living his life. See, broken That's home. Important. Broken yeah. home, am I correct? Yeah, but my mother is a strong woman. Yeah, but she, you were... She handled six kids with the need of man. Really? That's right. Yeah, but maybe that yeah. psychologically messed you up because all these guys you're hooking with are like your daddy. Uh, not at all. I only have one daddy. Yeah, but you know what I mean. You're looking for love from your daddy. I, oh, I have that. You know, I have that. You're looking for power <laughs> over men because of your daddy. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> I have power over the interest. Yeah, that's right. You do. <laughs> See? Now, um, in fact, her father is now producing Hugh Grant's next movie. Is that right? That's right. That's See? right. Yeah. Now, is your dad remarried? Yes, he, he is. He is. See? Mm -hmm. That's the psychological thing. Oh. And what age did you lose your virginity? Were you like 14 or something? Oh, no. Much you, older. Uh, get out of here. You're yeah. kidding. Mm -hmm. And you never even thought you'd be a hooker, right? No. It just sort of happened. Are you married? Sort of happened. No. Nope. You're not? No. Well, who, who got you into this? Fred Norris. Me. <laughs> hey, look. Really? You didn't the, have the bills, the you, rent. You don't have no pimp? <laughs> no pimp. You didn't have a pimp? Not a pimp. Dancing couldn't bring in enough money? No. Oh. Dancing is chump change. Yeah. It is? Yeah. How much you, seriously, how much can you make being a hooker or that? Like a, a thousand bucks a night? Oh, it gets more than that. Really? That's right. Two grand? Yes. Really? You can get a good fish in the sea and, and don't have to work for a week. Are wow. you serious? That's right. You mean like if you go up to a guy's car and he's a real rich guy? Oh, yeah. But the, but like the, like when you negotiate price and everything with him, you can size him up. Yeah. You get good at that. Once you get in, he's yours. Really? So like a guy, like some low life in a Rambler or something. He, he might. You just let him go by. You might let him go by, or see, that could be the guy with the money. Oh, see, you never know. You never check know. out everybody, right. huh? Are they all drunk or like some of them sober? Not enough. Really? Some of them sober. Some of them come. So, so like, if you look at a guy like me, you could size me up. And what would you charge well, a guy like me? Ah! Oh, come on, like looking at me. Okay, I pull up in a car. Now let's say it's a junky car. Okay, <laughs> you, you're looking at me. What do you charge me? I just need a little bliss, honey. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Looking for a party. First, I stick my nose in. <laughs> See how bad it smells? <laughs> so then you'd be out the door. <laughs> I don't have a good stink about me. No, come on. Seriously. T take a look at a guy like... All right, take a look at me and Jackie and Fred. What would you charge for a guy? For, for the this three guy. of them are in the same car. Fred over there. <laughs> yeah, we need, a, we need a, a triple. No, no, I'm saying... Now, take a look at Fred, for example. That's Fred over there in that corner. All right, the Jeep. scary one. He's in a Jeep. He drives a Jeep. What do you charge a guy like that? Be honest. It depends. What would you size him up for? On how he talked to me. It right. depends. Right, Fred, say something, uh, say say something, something. Fred. And don't scare her. Good evening. How are you? Nice to see you. Would you care to come in the back of my Jeep? <laughs> No. no. <laughs> you wouldn't go with him. You would not? Why? He scares you? Yeah. He does, right? Hugh He's Grant, she goes with me. She doesn't. I well, don't you're a it. psycho. Oh, please. She doesn't even know me. What about Jackie? Jackie, pick, Jackie, pick her up for real. Don't, don't try to be funny. You want to hop in? Mm-mm. Too you, much of a cop. Too much? He looks like a cop. Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah. Like she's an being, Irish she's cop. She's being too picky. All right. No. How do you make $2,000 if you That's why I lived so long. Really? Right? In that business. Did you have friends who got killed? picky. Yeah. You did? Really? Yeah. You saw girls like get chopped up and stuff? Not chopped up. Like what? No. OD? <laughs> no, what'd they do? Like how'd they get killed? Like they got murdered? Yeah. By their Johns? Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. You can look at a guy and know if he's sick? Yeah. And so and so far for Fred these and two are out. Huh? So Jackie looks like yeah. a cop and Fred looks I was like a guy who a very picky guy. Does Fred look like someone who who's capable of murder? Sure. Yeah, that one. Say so yes. Oh. That's the right answer. Say so yes. Oh yes. Are you serious? He really does? Really? He would scare you right off the bat. <laughs> Fred, I told you you're scary. Well, that's one woman's opinion. Wow. Well, Fred's upset now. He's got turned by I'm very, I'm very it's insulted. A a looker. Don't be insulted. <laughs> no. It's just show it's, business. It's not every day you get called a psychopath. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it is. A yes, it is. <laughs> On this show, it is. Yes, yeah. yes. I forgot where I what was. What about me? Uh, let me try. Uh, hey. Uh, no, I, I'll, I'll jump in the car with you, you very would? quick. And how much money would you charge me? Seriously. I would charge you. What is it? I would take him. him.
to the Versatile. Real as yeah. that? Straight to the Versatile. What's the Versatile? The little card that you stick in the night machine. Oh, you take me over to my bank machine. Right. Yeah. yeah. She says she could get you to just empty your bank account. She's calling really? him a sucker. Yeah. yeah. You think yeah. I'm a mark, huh? Not a big one, though. <laughs> really? <laughs> so he's a cop, I'm a psycho, and he's a sucker. Am I really? I'd rather be a psycho than a sucker. <laughs> That's right. I'd rather be a cop huh? than either. Yeah, but <laughs> anybody ever pull you in the car and like say, hey, we're going to a party and have you do some chicks and everything and like, you know, get some girls in front of them? You ever do any lesbian stuff? No. Never? Mm. Not into it? Mm. And your new porno, you must do some lesbian stuff. Yeah. True. You do? Yeah. Oh, you do? Yeah. You like that, don't you? I bet you like that because you're sick of guys. I like was what was being done. <laughs> right. So you let girls do you, but you don't. <laughs> Look, you're just having a You are so horny. <laughs> Now you gotta hate it men. It was a great experience. A lot of hookers hate men, man. It was. It's a good yeah. movie. It'll be. It's yeah. Be a, I'll good watch movie. it. I'll watch it. Why not? Are you up on all fours in this movie? Oh yeah. You are. Mm -hmm. Oh, super. And you recreate the whole Hugh Grant thing. Yeah. You do. Yes. Oh no kidding. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like so to see. So you didn't know who he was? It's been, not at all. Really. It's terrible. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, well, you know, she's a street girl. She's so not. So what into, did he say to you? She's not into those white boy movies, <laughs> right? <laughs> Ever have sex with Jack Gordon? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing hanging around with Jack? Have you met Latoya? No. You haven't. No. He's keeping the two of them apart. Yeah. <laughs> that, hey, that's what they do, right? All right? And what is Jack doing? He's managing you now. No. What is he doing? He, he's a good friend. He's a friend. You know you him? Yeah. I just yeah. Did you do him? No. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you did, yeah. didn't you? Come yeah. on. Hey, no. Jack, get your ass in here. Oh. <laughs> Get your cancerous ass in here. He took him to the bank machine. That's oh, yeah. Ass. <laughs> yeah, he had the cancer. He beat it, though. He beat it. He says he's, he beat he's it. He's got the cancer gone. <laughs> he beat cancer and he beat Latoya. He did it all. Oh, Where is he? Come here, Jack. He still says he didn't do that. <laughs> you beat the cancer, right, Jack? I did what? How you doing? I love Jack Gordon. Huh? You do? <laughs> he threw a chair at the cancer. Jack, I know you're involved with Latoya as a husband and manager. Jesus Christ. But how are you uh, involved with Divine Brown? We're just good friends, Howard. She took you to the bank machine, didn't yeah. she? Got it. Got it all. Got it all. <laughs> Look at the watch on Jack. <laughs> the ring, the watch. Who bought that for you, Latoya? Yeah. 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 What, how much is that jewelry worth that you're wearing? You're wearing diamond watch, and you got you got hands like a girl. It's a chandelier. Look at that. I'm telling you. Jack Gordon's got long fingernails like a woman. That's called true love, Howard. Did you become gay on me, or God what? Good. <laughs> what the hell is that? No, but what, what is with all the jewelry, man? It looks very yeah, effeminate. you've never been like this before. He probably took all of Latoya's money. <laughs> Where is Latoya? Where is Latoya? Well, they Latoya's haven't found here. her body yet. He's trying to impress the mom. Yeah, you know, what's going on with all the fancy jewelry? Where'd you get the money for that? Oh, Latoya bought it. Did she really? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah? yeah. Hey, have you guys... Uh, uh, Have you made, made a child a baby yet? yet? Not sure, but very close. Jack, ah! Latoya wants. <laughs> Divine don't even believe close. it. <laughs> you know how long he's trying to get Latoya pregnant, <laughs> Divine? He, like two years already. No. Yeah, he can't do it. God. It's a long and short of it. Really? What's going on? Have you had sex with her? Oh, of course. Recently? Yeah. And what happened? No baby? Not yet. How many times are you doing it a month? We keep thinking about you, Howard. How many times a month are you doing it? Oh, a lot, a lot. Really? A lot, a lot. Well, I bet you Divine could get pregnant in two seconds. Man, fertilizer. I need to give her some of mine. You're not kidding. I'm like, puh. What are you doing with Divine Brown? I don't understand. Oh, we're just friends. Yeah. We're you're, just friends. You're just friends. Yeah. yeah. No business relationship. So Aaron, my son, has mm. done her movie. He's in the movie. No, no, no. He no. produced the movie. He's, he produced yes. it. Yeah. Oh, I see. Yeah. I see. So he's Jack's producing. Jack's son the isn't performing yet. No. <laughs> no. Unbelievable. And who? And uh, why don't you let your son get Latoya pregnant? He's got young sperm. Let him do it. <gasps> It'll be him. like your baby. I'm It'll be like. <laughs> I'm waiting for your sperm, Howard. <laughs> but are you still trying, seriously? Yeah, very. Did you go to sperm uh, doctor or anything? Everything. We, you, yeah, you've yeah. been to the doctor. Oh, sure. Yeah. Are you? What are you doing now? Turkey baster? No, I think they skipped the turkey. They, I, think they, I think the doctor just made an incision in his nuts. Oh went, right, went, went right for the operation, oh right? No. You'll do it, pal. Don't worry about it. You know what it is? You're just nervous. And so you got to relax. I'm liking the way Divine looks. Man. I'm telling you. Oh, she's a very nice girl. She What's really it cost for, to get you when you were a hooker? 20 30 No more. 100 bucks? As much as you over. can. <laughs> over a hundred, or are you just lying? That's not that's true. A street that's hooker, a hundred bucks? That's right, a hundred and up. I do not believe it. No. I don't believe it, baby. Hey, the proof is in the pudding. Right. I mean, I pay a nice, I give you a nice 50 bucks. I just wonder what Hugh Grant, Hugh Grant rolls up. <laughs> You'll get that took, too. Really? Yeah. You'll take my 50 I'll bucks. I'll take it. Have you ever stolen from a guy? You ever beat a guy up in his car and taken his money? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah, you're tough broad. I'm sure you could kick my ass. <laughs> How tall are you? Like five, five. Yeah? So what do you do? You go in and just punch the guy in the face and just grab his money and get out? Oh, no. What do you do? Be sweet. You just roll them when they're drunk? 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I hear you. I, I know what happens because one of my friends told me that this happens. When the pants are around their ankles and the guy's got his eyes closed, he just reach in his pocket and take his wallet. <laughs> <laughs> Is that right? That's right. <laughs> oh. oh, my goodness. <laughs> I think that happened to Jack a few times. Ah. Wow, wow. Uh, who else is in your entourage with you for this? Uh, oh. Who is here today? Let's see. You got and who's that really good-looking woman that's with you guys? Is she in the movie? Is that the one who's busy yes, with you? Yes, that's Kim Contain. Kim hey Contain? Now. Yeah. That's Ron Jeremy's good girlfriend. <laughs> and what, you brought Ron Jeremy down here? Yeah, he is did. he here again? Leave him outside. Ron Jeremy has come <laughs> down here seven times, and each time we never let him in. Right. Leave him out in the hall. Leave him out. Oh, Bring Ronnie, in everybody I'm sorry, else. Ronnie. Howard, he's a big fan. <laughs> yeah, he's a big fan, but he's not going to be in here. That's all. <laughs> Bring in everybody else and leave Ron there. Ron Jeremy's <laughs> career is as cursed as Superman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, he can't get another role. That's right. Ron, what is it like coming here every single time and, and, and never getting on? I think it's kind of fun, you know, like they give me a nice little plug. I mean, John Bobbitt told Howard that I brought Ice-T into the Bobbitt movie. And then, like, they give me little plugs. And in this case, I directed the movie, and I I'm also have a scene in the film, so... I figured, you know, they might mention it, and it promotes the movie, you know. So it's nice to go on, but I, I enjoy being in the movie. Are you dying to get in? Is that? No, I've been on the show a couple times. Yeah. I was on the show with John Bobbitt and Uncut. But you're, I was like, on the but show you're with so Sam. close. You're like a couple this days away. This close! I was on the show also with Sam Kennison. He used to come on the show. I used to call in, and I'd been on the show. And I used to call in when he was local, before he was even nationwide, you know. Uh-huh. So, I've, you know, it's Let, it's let me tell you something. The only reason why Ron wanted to direct this movie was so he could possibly get on Howard. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, that's the only reason why I wanted to direct the movie. Just to be an Howard Stern show, you know. I dig your little belly shirt. I dig that. Not you, Jack. (laughs) (laughs) What do you like? (laughs) All right, so wait a second. You're growing up when she turned the first trick? Oh, okay. You can't find out anything. Devine, you got to tell me something. Jack, you know what? Get Jack out of here because he's really annoying. Yeah, all of a sudden he's handing out He's ripping out newspapers. Jack, you're you're gone. You're gone. You're annoying. I'll see you later. All right, take it easy, Jack. Kid. Tell Latoya we said hello. Yeah, tell Latoya we said hello. I will. Good luck getting her pregnant. <laughs> it's a real tough job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, anyway. Talk to me. So wait a second. So what age do you start becoming a hooker? How old were you? Oh, they, they, they start young. And what age well, did you start? You, how old did you start? Yeah. I started when I was uh, 18. 18? Like 17. Now, how did you get into it? How The first time you did it, what was, what was the circumstance? Circumstances, you know, you just you, you see a lot of things that you want, and your financially income is not there, right. you know, and um, you be around a lot of nice things and a lot yeah, of you, you know money. people who were hookers. Yeah, I knew a young lady that uh-huh. was a working girl, but she didn't turn me on to it. Uh-huh. You know, I was foreseeing the money. You know, that was. You just saw how much money she had. Right. Right. So what happens with it? What did you do? You just walked out on the street? And the things that she used to get, you know, Uh used to be, I just, you know. So what did you do? So so I understand that. So then you went out, and so you went out on the street, and, like, you just stopped a car and said, you know, you went down to where all the hookers hang out? You must have been scared out of your mind, right? Yeah, I was scared, but I couldn't let no one else know that. Right. You had to, you couldn't show any fear. That's right. And the first guy, do you remember the first guy you ever did for money? Of course. You do? Yeah. You always remember your first. And always. Was he a good-looking guy, or was he just some ugly little bald guy? He oh. was a lawyer. A lawyer. Now, how did you know that? Did you ask him? Yes, I did. And you, uh, the first guy you ever and did? he also knew that I was. that was my first time. He did? But I denied it. Oh, he could tell, though. Yeah. Well, everybody's so oh. intuitive. You know, the lawyer knew hookers, and she knows right. John's. Was he fat? <laughs> was he a fat, like, smelly guy? No. No? no. <laughs> I'm a fat lawyer. <laughs> so wait a second. So you went down to the car, and you sa- and then you had to negotiate for the first time, right? Yeah. So what'd you ask him for? Did you price yourself a little low because it was your first time? No. You knew what to ask. Yeah. What'd you ask for? I listened to the girls. What did they ask for? A hundred dollars. A hundred dollars. That's right. And the guy said, hey, get my car, baby. You looked him over. You said, hey, I think this guy's safe. Yeah. And I told him to park his car and come with me. Let's walk down the street. Oh. You know, and that him knowing that it was my first time, right? Yeah. That's why he knew. He gave me a big bonus. He did? Uh-huh. A very big bonus. And then you were hooked. Yeah. And you liked it. It's that easy. And, but when you, you, know? you yeah, but when you went home, were you, like, disgusted? Like, were you, like, like brushing your teeth? No, I was happy. You were happy? I was happy. I went home and took a hot bath and Listerine. And oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, you washed yourself out oh, good. Oh, for sure. Mm. Yeah. So you felt disgusting, like, like ugh, this guy's gross. But I can't, yeah, but it, I, felt, I felt, you know, like, I was happy, but it didn't take much. Right. So you can go out to a bar and meet a one-night stand, but you're giving them your all. Right. You know. I see. You go out. And handle your business, and you, you're doing it to handle your business. 
So you separate things right. out. That's you have right. business and pleasure. That's, you got so it. So you got a boyfriend that you like having sex with. Love. You love it. Love it. That's that guy out there? That's your boyfriend? That young man out there? Yeah. Yes. That's your boyfriend? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. How long have you known him? I've been knowing him for seven years. Oh, really? Yeah, so he's been with you through all of uh, <laughs> your career. <laughs> now, do you share your money with him? Beep. <laughs> <laughs> what does he do? Well, yeah, what is his occupation? Oh, he's, he's a man of his, he handles his own business. He has his own business. Yes, he's a good businessman. Where is that guy? I want to meet this yeah. guy. Would he come in here? Let me let me talk to him. I don't know. <laughs> you don't he know? He won't come in. He's looking, come in here. He's low key? Yes. He don't like the cameras. Oh, he doesn't. <laughs> put a bag on his head. He's not into none of that. Put a bag that. over his head. <laughs> no. That's all. He's not going out like that. He's, her boy, her boyfriend's very camera shy. Oh, is he? He's yes. not coming understood, in. Understood, understood, yeah. understood. But her manager wants to come in. His name is, what's his name? Money? Van Banks. Money, Money Van Banks? Money no. <laughs> Van Banks. Van yes. Banks. Well, you got a whole entourage. You certainly do. That's Money. Really yes, I have a entourage. All right, listen. Just to get this straight, though, this guy, you Grant, right? So you meet him that night, mm -hmm. and you look in there, and you didn't even think he was that good looking. I don't think you Grant's that good looking. I've seen him. He's good looking. Really? Yeah. Did you think he was good looking? Mm -hmm. You did? Mm -hmm. You were like, hey, this is like one of the better looking guys He's I got to do? very sexy man. So what does he do? He pulls up and he just says, hey, like, what's his line to you? Like, did he, did he seem he experienced? Drunk? <laughs> Yes. He was drunk, yeah. okay. No, he was drunk. So how come he didn't get uh, nabbed for drunk driving? They had him for this, and they said they don't care about his drinking, I suppose. He was loaded, huh? Yes. Ah, uh, damn. How come, how come he can drive around drunk and he doesn't get... Uh, really? Busted. Yeah, and busted. There you go, baby. Yeah, she's upset about that. So am I. Are you upset about that? Yes. You are upset? Yeah. Double standard. <laughs> 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 I didn't realize you were political. <laughs> and you, um, and so the guy pulls up, and you look, and you say, "Hey, at least if I got to do this for money, at least this guy's halfway decent looking, right?" So you were attracted to him? No. Not at all. Right. You don't like Johns? No. They disgust you. Very much so. Understood. Why? Because they have wives at home, and they go out and trick. Right. They're deceitful. Deceitful. Non-trusting. But thank God for them, or else you can't make a living. You do it once, you do it again. Right. You did it, but you just got caught. Now, you think you, Grant will do it again? I don't think it was his first time. <laughs> you, did you I get don't the think so. yeah, yeah, Seriously, did you get the impression? You can tell when a guy it's his first time to a hooker. I can tell a trick, a trick. You're saying, you, in your humble a opinion. A normal guy that comes out and handle his business. Right. You're saying this guy really knew how to handle his business. He was experienced at going to hookers, in your estimation? Yeah. Yes. Well, you're not on the witness stand. Relax. Uh. <laughs> you can say more than you can yeah. do more than answer the question. <laughs> she's, on a, she's on trial. Oh and, uh... <laughs> All right. So he's there, and then you get in the car. How long does it take you to decide to get in the car that he's safe? How long does it take you? Well, after he didn't drove around me for, like, two miles. Right. He, oh, so he kept circling. He kept circling? <laughs> Did you think that was funny? You knew he was looking you over, right? I thought he was a cop, man. Right. And then you went over, and you. how do you know he's not a cop? How did you know? Because he showed me that big... Whopper. He showed oh, you his really? genitals. You said, let me see your penis. Right? Yes, I did. And that's how you know it's not a cop, because a cop's not allowed to show you his penis, right? So he just pulled it right up. See, did huh? you know that, Robin? No. Officer oh, wow, he showed it. Officer Jackie. <laughs> <laughs> well, you caught me, lady. I can't show you my penis. Look at his penis. I'll show it to you anyway. Right. <laughs> wow, that's interesting. I, that's a little trick of the trade I didn't know. Yeah, see, he must have known what he was doing. He knew. <laughs> All right, so then you look at, you look at him over, right, Divine? Yes. Stay with me, baby. No, yeah. All right, I know you're tired. Come over here. Get over here, baby. Get on that microphone. Treat it like it's a man. <laughs> and when he took it out, was it as big as a... Let me show you. You see this cucumber? Whoa. Was it as big as that? Or oh. was it as big as this cucumber? Whoa. Was it curved Whoa. like that cucumber? Was it as big as this... Oh. Was it oh. big like this oh, eggplant? Man. Oh, my God. Is that, oh, like you haven't seen that. <laughs> or was it as big as this hot dog? <laughs> Which, was it big? How big was it? Seriously, I want to know. Come on, Divine, honey. I'm being square with you. Square business. You are. Yeah, come on. And I adore that. I know. So so how big was he? Was he like three inches? Was he tiny? Man, it's in the bug, man. I wrote a bug. So I'm tell not, me. I'm not going to upgrade Just give me inches. Him. I'm not going to insult him. But, that's not know. an insult. <laughs> how, I mean, that's like talking about a man's arm. What's the difference? Is it three inches? Is he tiny? He's all right. 
He, he is all right? He's a, draw it. They draw it. Give her a pen and draw it. You guys are bad. Show no me how big way. it was. You draw it, honey. No. You divine. I'll come over there. <laughs> you ain't got no pimp around you now. I have to protect you. I'll come over. I have to mess you up. Go ahead. Pick one. Pick one of those. One, two, three, or four. Oh Which one? God. Gosh. Uh, that one? Oh, that's let me small. see what she picked. Oh, no. She picked a thing that's not more than an inch. Oh, this one. That one? Yeah. Oh, that's stop it. it. Oh. Was that full blown? Oh. Oh, Are you saying, so to speak, oh. is that uh, is that fully aroused? Oh, man. You guys are terrible. No, oh. come on. <laughs> <laughs> is that fully excited? An inch? Oh, my God. Come on. You know what I'm talking about, honey. This is, the, this is the word of the street. The word of the street. Yeah. And what about you? Did you ever get any AIDS or syphilis or herpes? Hell no. Hell no. How did you avoid that, my sweet? <laughs> How did you avoid that? Just say no. Really? Because you always use a condom, right? That's right. Right. Mm. Man, look at the size of you, Grant. That's not even <laughs> That's an appetizer. That's not possible. That's nothing. That's not possible. Yeah. You wouldn't even what? have been able to do your job. Yeah, how'd you do your business? <laughs> Did you laugh when you saw it? I couldn't put it on. Ah, you could have put the condom on. <laughs> You, was, you couldn't even put the condom on. You needed a baby oh, condom, right? These are hilarious. Were you laughing? One of those that he had on his One of those baby condoms. <laughs> did you laugh when you saw the size of it? Did you kind of laugh yeah, to yourself? Yeah, you keep your, straight, your face straight? <laughs> Divine, did you laugh when you saw Hugh Grant's uh, genitalia? No. You did not. Mm. You tried to be professional and not make the man feel uncomfortable. So he wasn't even no. in an excited state. Yes, he was excited. And oh, he was in God. it. Oh. oh, my Lord. Did you get a discount? <laughs> <laughs> no. So you got in the car and right away you started doing your business on him or he gives you the money first? <laughs> money first. Money up front. That's and he was very generous, $100? Oh, yeah. Okay, $100. Generous. And you start to do your business on him with the condom. <laughs> and you never even got to finish, did you? Because the cops came right over and busted you. <laughs> was, that, was that the first time you got busted? Me? Yeah. No. No, it's happened before. Right? So what? So what'd you do? You spent the That's night in jail? Part of the business, no. I suppose. What? Not even a night. How'd Who you came get out? And get an you hour. out. Who came and got you out? Your boyfriend? No. I walked out. You walked out? Yeah. They just kept you for an hour. Yeah. Wow. And was you Grant crying when they busted him? Was he like, oh man? Whining, man. Was he? Whining. What'd he say? This guy is telling everything. What <laughs> What was he saying? He should have just kept he his just mouth shut. Huh? <laughs> he could should have denied, 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 right? Just said, hey, look, this is my lady. What, what, what's, she what got business? a little sick. She yeah. Head in my lap. Yeah, she, had, she, she, she was <laughs> nauseous. <laughs> so what did he do? He started blabbing and saying who he was? Yes. And did you go, what a fool? <laughs> <laughs> they said, well, how much money did he give you, ma'am? He didn't give me anything. That's what you said. Yeah. Right. And, and what did he, he say? He started. Yeah, I gave her. A oh, <laughs> my God. He told right off. Yeah. A fool. Fool. What a fool. <laughs> By now, did he have his pants up when the cops? Let me get Oh, yeah, something. the pants were down. So when the cops look in the glass window, did he have his pants off with that tiny thing? Uh, yeah. He did. Oh. And, and like, how'd they, see it? how'd they see it? There's no evidence. You guys are terrible. <laughs> so when they, when the cops are talking to him, did he put his pants back on, or was it hanging out? <laughs> did he have to get out of the car with his pants? Down? <laughs> yeah. No, they gave him time to pull him up. They did, mm -hmm. but when they were interrogating him, when they asked him, you know, what are you doing in there? It was, it was out. <laughs> yeah, when they were looking in the window with, with the, the flashlight. flashlight. That must have been a strong flashlight. Ah, <laughs> if to see there. that thing, <laughs> they must have had a searchlight. That's <laughs> awful. <laughs> Officer said, "Oh, this guy's not doing anything wrong. There's nothing. Oh, oh, there it is. <laughs> no shadow from that thing." <laughs> so, so when they were looking in with the flashlight, they saw his thing. I b I'm sure. They saw his nonsense? No. I see. <laughs> did the cops laugh at the size of it? I'm sure they did. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're a sweet doll. <laughs> yes. Let's take a phone call for Divine Brown. She has her new uh, porno video out. She was with Hugh Grant. Yes, you're on the air. Hello? Yes. Is this how it's done? Yes, yes. baby. Yeah, um, I'd like to know where you get off trying to promote uh, a young black woman on the street prostituting herself, demeaning herself, and degrading herself. And you know you got a huge audience. You appeal to a Thank lot you. of people. There's a lot of black women out there. What kind of role model is she supposed to be? Who said she was a role model? If that's your role model, you're in big you're trouble, trouble, honey. <laughs> you don't pick any better than that. Hey, this, I mean, hey look, this you're, young you're sister still fell on you're some... You're still promoting it by having her on a show. You oh. can go to her activity, asking her how she got into it. Hey, I've had white prostitutes woman. on my show. What's yeah. the difference? What, are you going to keep black prostitutes off? Why, why, don't you, why don't you have a nice Jewish prostitute on there, like Heidi Fleiss? Why don't you get her on your show? I've had her on three times. Huh? I had her on three show? times, you whore. 
You filthy kike, you. You, you filthy half kike. Half kike. You hook nose kike, you. You filthy ugly. You girl. scumbag, filthy you bitch. Filthy, ugly, nasty, you filthy, ugly, nasty, you nasty, filthy you hoe. Come down here. I want to beat ugly, your girl. wicked ass. I'll take. Why don't you put your decrepit, ugly Jewish mother on the street? My oh, yeah? I'll herself. put you out on the street, you little filthy okay. whore. You, you make me scum, sick. You, you scumbag. You, nasty, you piece of garbage scum. jerk off. They should have put, they should have put your mother in Auschwitz. Maybe you wouldn't be here right now. You filthy. Your rat-infested private parts. You probably can't even get a man. You skank. <laughs> <laughs> Told her off. <laughs> <laughs> that was Hugh Grant's mother. <laughs> yeah, did you hear her disguising her voice? <laughs> Whoa. How dare you talk and, about my son? <laughs> and, hey, and by the way, you are saying, in your humble estimation, that Hugh Grant will be out there cheating again on that Elizabeth Hurley, oh, don't yeah. you? Oh, definitely. Definitely. Well, listen here, my little sister. Hey, now. Time is up. Mr. Clock says it's time for you to oh. go. But let me tell you something. We had some fun, didn't we, baby? Yeah, we did. Of course we did. Don't you let that little scabby skank get on. Do you get attacked on. by people like that? Uh, uh, often? Never. No? No, they're just well, jealous. Yeah, they only call on the phone when yeah, they get they're the anonymous. Jealous. They're jealous of your fine body and ass. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> All right. Anyway, uh, let's just say Divine Brown has a video. So up. is the hooking over? That's the one thing we have to Hell clear no. up now. Hell no. Hell no. I mean, you know, um, it's it's over when, it, when the fat lady sings. Hmm. Who would that be? Oprah? <laughs> hey, 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 I love that lady. Really? Yeah. You like her? I like her. You like Oprah? I like her. Yeah, so don't go there. Don't, don't go, go there, there girl. <laughs> Did you say don't go there? Don't go there. <laughs> yeah, I love that. <laughs> yes. All right, anyway, listen, let me uh, let me say uh, thank you, So you're you, not saying Brown. no to anything. Your life, you're yes, going I, along I, now, I you're have working. I my, my limit. When's you the know? last time you had a John? Was enough it you? Is enough. You, Grant, was the last guy you had? Oh, yeah. That was the last yeah. one. All right, well, I hope And all the court stuff is straightened out? Is that all over? Yeah, yeah, you know, it, it's. I have to go back to court May second. Uh huh. You know, to finish up some stuff that that um, I believe they got lost somewhere. Uh huh. You know? Some business. Yeah. Mm -hmm. you know? mm -hmm. But that's that's it. it you know, do me a favor. Things. Do Fred and Jackie during the commercials. All right. Oh, give them a little. Give them. Give them a little freebie. Yeah. <laughs> you know what pay I'm saying? Up, boy. You pay up. Pay up. <laughs> that's all, thank you. I'm telling you. She no freebies no, here. No freebies here. <laughs> Did you give the judge a beeper number? That's how you get out of that. <laughs> a beeper number. Yeah. A beeper number. Give me a beeper number before you leave. All right. Let's hope that you stay off the streets, Divine, and uh, start a whole new life. This oh, is yeah. your uh, now your film career. Have you gotten any other offers, like your more legitimate offers? Like uh, Yeah, I got some very good offers. You did? Yeah. I see. Uh, show business type offers? Oh, yeah. What, to be in a film? To be in films, to do uh, commercials, to do... Uh, commercials? Yeah. How come I can't get in a commercial? To, um... <laughs> you don't have a good enough <laughs> reputation. Yeah. <laughs> I need to start hooking. After that phone call. <laughs> that is Divine Brown. Tough? No, not at all. I enjoyed it. Did you have a good time in there? It was a piece of cake, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. You didn't mind telling all the stories? No, not at all. Not at all? No. All right, good. So, did you like Howard? What did you think of Howard? Howard's a great guy. I would love to be back on the show again. Yeah? All right, good, good. You don't, you don't think you're going to get in any trouble for this, are you? By whom? By, uh, by anybody, <laughs> you, or... You don't think... Have you... You've never heard from his people or anybody, right? No. No, nobody's tried to make any comments no. or anything like that? No. Hey, Jackie, how you doing there? All right, good. All right, well, thanks, thanks for coming. Man. Thank you. I enjoyed myself. Very good. All right, good. Thanks. I'll be back.